We're back tonight as the Birmingham City Council has delayed a decision regarding an agreement that would allow a Major League Baseball Youth Training Academy to be built at George Ward Park in Birmingham. A hot debate. CBS 42's Cameron Edgeworth live in the newsroom tonight with how city leaders are addressing concerns that that academy would displace current sports tournaments happening at that park. Cameron. Jack, that's right, and the Birmingham Parks and Recreation Board says there is false information out there concerning the future of facilities at the park if the academy is built there, but the debate over where it should be located continues. The Birmingham City Council postpones a decision on whether a MLB Youth Training Academy should be built at George Ward Park. We haven't really accomplished anything except to say some ugly words to each other. The council delayed the decision until next Tuesday. MLB wants to invest at least $5 million to put the training academy at the park. Some fear it would displace current softball tournaments that generate several hundred thousand dollars in revenue for the city. Good shot. Nathan Eccles has been coaching tennis at the park for six years. He and other community members are concerned the academy would leave them without a place to play. I wouldn't like it if you're going to remove this tennis facility. I wouldn't like it at all. Birmingham Parks and Recreation Commissioner Larry Crockle says no other facilities would be impacted outside of the baseball and softball complex. And normally they uh, utilize uh, the six fields there. After the development is completed, we will have three, but we're looking at you know developing um, the Cooper Green um, sites as well to make certain that they still have access to the uh, six fields that are needed. But Birmingham City Councilor Valerie Abbott says breaking up the softball complex would negatively impact the tournaments. The City Council is currently debating on whether the Youth Academy should be built at another Birmingham park. The Parks and Recreation Board says MLB chose George Ward Park due to its central location near the interstate and UAB. Reporting live in the newsroom, Cameron Edgeworth, CBS 42 News. Local coverage you can count on.